Hey guys, Footy Manager TV here, and today I have got a special video for you guys, especially if you like FIFA 15 career mode videos. I am going to be taking part in the FIFA 15 online career mode, and you're probably thinking to yourself, Online career mode? There's no online career mode in FIFA 15. That is why myself and seven other FIFA career mode YouTubers have decided to create our own online career mode within FIFA 15. It's something I'm really excited about and hopefully it can be received really well by you guys, just the whole community, hopefully, not just my subscribers and everyone else's subscribers, who I will show you now. He'll be taking part in this. The eight YouTubers, or seven YouTubers, other than myself. Uh, go through them right now. This is just the table before any games have been played. Uh, Chunny Sports, Chesnoid Gaming, Conflict, DJ99, and you see myself there as well. Uh, Full Metal Zoe, Pepsi FIFA, fellow Australian YouTuber, and to round it off, Tom LFC Heaven. So... I'm sure you want to know how this is going to work, and I'm going to go through that really, really quickly. But next, I'm going to show you the fixtures, who's going to be playing who, uh, so you can get really excited about it. Uh, but yeah, drop a like on this video and subscribe to all these uh, guys who will be ready for their videos. Uh, we will be playing two match days per week, but I'll go through that in the rules part of this video. But yes, here's the fixture list. The first fixture... Uh, the first game week is going to be the first game, uh, DJ99 versus Tom LFC Heaven, uh, Chesnoid Gaming versus Chunny Sports, Pepsi FIFA v Odd Conflict, and myself. I'm going to be playing at home for the first game, even though it's probably not going to matter home or away. Uh, but yes, I'm going to be playing against Full Metal Zoe. I am really excited <laughs> to get this underway. And yes, this weekend, uh, the first games are going to be uploaded and played by us as well uh, but like I said there will be two during the week and I think the others will be uploaded on Tuesday and Wednesday and yes this first fixture will be Saturday and Sunday and that will be the same every single week and you'll see this here as I go through the first part of the rules it says eight teams in the league two against everyone so play home and away fixtures two match days every week as I just mentioned match days will be uploaded on Saturday Sunday yeah Saturday or Sunday just Instead of having, because sometimes, yeah, someone may not be able to upload on a certain day because of other series commitments. Even like myself as well, got heaps going and uh, ones I'm currently doing won't take a break because this is only going to be two uploads per, le uh, per week uh, because of it. So that will be all right. But yes, on the weekends, uh, we'll be uploaded uh, midday UK time, uh, 12 p.m. And also Tuesday and Wednesday during the week, 5:30 uh, p.m. UK time. Want to get them a suitable time for uh, UK viewers, and it's similar times around Europe as well. Not too drastic difference, I'm led to believe. Anyway, it's yeah, a good upload time on the weekends around the midday and during the week on the Tuesday and Wednesday evenings at 5:30 p.m. So I reckon that sounds all right. But yes, the teams we are going to manage. No, no, no. We're not going to be big teams. We have to select a team with a maximum rating of 3.5 stars. So we're not going to have superstars from right away. And you're probably thinking, where's the fun in that? You're going to find that out very, very soon. Uh, but yes, I'll give the give away the team I've been. You'll see it a bit later, the other, the other teams uh, from the other YouTubers. But I have chose Norwich, who are actually a second division team. You think there's some three and a half star teams in the Premier League, but I feel Norwich... Uh, you'll see it in my games anyway. I'll give an overview of my squad and all that good stuff. Uh, you'll see my squad. And yeah, I'm sure you agree. If you've checked out Norwich yourself, if you've done a career mode with them, they've got a decent team. But yes, now moving on to the rules of the actual competition and how we upgrade. And this is basically, this acts as the transfers. These are the transfers. So here's the rules if we win. If you win a game... If we win a game, <laughs> yeah, yeah, if we win a game, we are allowed to upgrade one player in our team by a maximum of a plus five overall. For example, you can upgrade a 77 overall player to 82, but you don't have to. If you think there's a better overall, like, yeah, from just use that 77 player as an example. If you find a better player or a player you like a lot more, it could be 80 rated or whatever. And this is what we're going to do, or at least me specifically. I'm pretty sure other guys are going to do this as well. Uh, we're going to let you guys, the community, the subscribers, vote the player you want to join our team or replace the previous player. 
Uh, so what I want to do, again, I'm not sure if other uh, other guys are going to do this, but I'm basically maybe going to get three names of a player. This is, yeah, pending if I win a game, of course. Uh, we'll see if I can do that. If I, but that's why I chose Norwich, actually, for a 3.5-star team. Um, I just I just feel I can win with them. That's a team I wanted to pick for the improvement. If I can, I wanted to pick a team, yeah, I could see myself winning with. Uh, players that can score and players that can defend <laughs> in a simple way. It turns out like that. And there's definitely weaknesses in every team. Uh, but yes, also, if we pick up a draw, uh, both players are allowed to upgrade a player by a maximum of plus two overall. So maybe you could play for a draw if you've got a certain player in mind. Oh, I don't know. Or of course, you'd want to win because that's where you can target some good players. Because uh, obviously, none of us will have superstars. We're all going to have an average squad. And like I said, each team, sure, every team can be good in certain areas, but every team is going to have a weakness. And that's what you have to look to exploit. But what if you lose? What is the penalty if you lose? Well then, you have to downgrade your keeper by a minus five overall. And you know the goalkeepers, low-rated goalkeepers in FIFA are really, really bad. And you don't want that. Uh, but also, you might have missed that, but... Uh, yeah, that's only a one-time thing. Say if you lose two times in a row, you don't get downgraded again. You wait until you win again, and then then you can get your normal keeper back. So you can't get any keeper you want when you win again. You just get your old one back, gets reset. But these are the teams that we are going to use. Uh, Chani Sports is going to be Sampdoria. Decent team, I reckon. That's going to be a tough team to beat. Chesnoid Gaming, Crystal Palace. I've taken a look at him, and <laughs> that team, uh, pretty pacey up front. Conflict is going to be being Hull City, kind of in the same boat. They've got some quality players for a 3.4, uh, 3.5 star team. Uh, DJ99 is going to be managing Andelect in this online career mode. They've got some decent players uh, to look out for. And of course, myself, Norwich City, already talked about that. Full Metal Zoe, my first opponent, Club America. They've always yeah got those kind of Mexicans, dangerous players. Uh, Pepsi FIFA going to be being fine or again another t uh, decent team and to round it off uh, Tom LFC Heaven is going to be managing Ren so that is it basically hopefully you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the first match day